friends, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and thanks so much for coming back to my channel. Nice to see you. I have a big event coming up in my life tomorrow. Well, first, my 35 year old son Colin is flying in for a birthday party tomorrow from one to three at our church. We're having a birthday party for Alan's 90 year old mother Darlene. Yes, she is 90 years old and she is doing just great. She is living on her own. She has a happy, positive attitude. She's really amazing. And we're so excited to celebrate her birthday. But the other day I, I asked her what she was going to wear and she said, oh, a dress, of course. And she said, now you'll be wearing a dress too, right? And uh, she gets kind of frustrated with me because I pretty much am a jeans and a top kind of a girl. Once in a while, I'll wear a pair of black trousers, but I've gotten very, very informal. And she always likes it when I wear a dress. So in this video, I'll be going through my Amazon dresses that I have bought this year and last year, pulled them out of my closet, and I'm going to try each of them on for you. And you can help me vote on which dress you would wear to Darlene's 90th birthday party. And I will tell you, please stick around to the end because I want to show you Darlene's birthday party. I have worked so hard on this. You know, I have tried to get perfect flowers and good matching paperware. I ordered some sandwiches, two cakes, and you know, it's just a birthday party at a church, but I'm really excited about it. So hang around to the end if you'd like to see some scenes from Darlene's 90th birthday party. And also I did want to tell you, this is my fifth bedroom in my house. What do we need with five bedrooms? Me and Alan are like in our 60s. But we finally got some bedroom furniture for this bedroom. We got it at Ashley Furniture. And actually there are two lines at Ashley, one of which is solid wood. And basically what the guy told me is most of the furniture on the lower level at Ashley is very good quality and it's solid wood. This bed is heavy as heck. It is solid wood from Ashley Furniture. And I guess the second floor has the lesser quality Ashley Furniture, but I really like this and I'll show you real quickly everything I've done with this room so far. It's still under construction and then I'll show you some dresses. Okay, this is a look at that basement bedroom. That's that Ashley Furniture set I told you about. Very reasonable and super quality. I was very surprised. And then I ordered the comforter set, the gingham comforter set, or the checked, I guess. Is that gingham? Yeah, I guess it is. I ordered that from Amazon and also the goose down comforter, although I think that's an alternative down comforter. I also ordered the lamps. They came in a set of two from Wayfair, I think, and those will go in the bathroom. And this is the picture that will go above the bed. There it is. Alan has not hung it up yet, even though we've had this for maybe three weeks, we've been really busy, but it will go right there. So things are still a little bit under construction. And these are the dresses that I'll be showing you in today's fashion show. Okay, I'm starting out with this dress because I am surprised by how much I like it. I really thought I would wear something a little more business-like looking, and I still may. But let me know in the comment section if you like a dress like this. It is a razorback style, so it does have coverage in the back, which is just great. It has the halter neckline, which I really like. It has a little self-tie belt, which I have a little bow tied there. And then look at this wonderful flippy asymmetric skirt. It has ruffle on each side, and it starts kind of high over there, but then it is a little lower than midi, almost ankle length on that side. I am really surprised by how much I like this. Let me know in the comment section if you like this, if you are going to a birthday party of a relative, would you wear something like this, which is a little casual and like a little sundress, or would you be a little more business-like? Let me know. Okay, this first dress is absolutely my favorite dress on Amazon. I have this in five different colors, and this is the black, and I love this dress. It is a polyester, I believe, but I love the little short flippy sleeves. It has ruching here, which really hides your tummy. It has a good length on it. It is not too short, and I love the way the skirt kind of, the ruffle goes down like that. Then I have on dream pair shoes, and these are some of my favorite shoes. They're very versatile because I wear them whenever I wear a dress, which it's rarely. But I do like the look of nude shoes with any color dress, including black, because I used to wear black with something like this, and it cut my legs off and made me look short and stubby. And so I really do like the nude shoes with this. And this is, you know, kind of could be a funeral dress. This is such a versatile dress. You can wear this dress to work, to meetings, even a cocktail party. And the neat thing about this dress is it washes up beautifully. I wash it in a normal washing cycle and then I hang it dry 
and it absolutely has no wrinkles and looks the same wash after wash after wash. This is a fabulous dress and I have it in five colors, but I'll show you two more colors to give you an idea of what it can look like in the different colors. Now here is the same dress in red and I absolutely love this. In fact, in the reviews, a sportscaster had this dress on and she looked fabulous. That was one of the main reasons I ordered it, but I also just love a red dress. And the thing about this dress, which makes it the best dress on Amazon, I really think it is, is when I looked at the reviews, women of all shapes and sizes looked fabulous in this dress. From the very curviest, largest ladies, voluptuous ladies, to very slender ladies, everybody looks great in this dress. And this ruching either conceals parts of your figure if you don't want it, or it gives you a figure if you need a little help in that area. Okay, this is the last time I will show you this dress. And I love this color. It is a teal blue. I think it's absolutely a striking color, especially in spring and summer. And as you can see, I also have it in burgundy and in navy blue, but I actually have a friend. I went on a girl's trip and one of the ladies, Kim, on the trip, she has a sister who, it's a long story, but she ended up losing all of her clothes and possessions. And apparently she's a pretty small size. So Kim asked if I could give her some leftover clothes. So I, I actually had two of these dresses in black. So I'll give her one of those. And also I'll probably give her the burgundy one. I'm not sure about the navy. I may keep that one. Okay, I've kind of changed gears with this dress. This is more of a summer cotton lightweight, kind of a kind of a informal dress, I would say, very informal. I love the halter neck on it. And it is a halter in the back. And that does not bother me because it's a summer dress. I'm not sure if this is too informal for her birthday party. It has a tiered skirt and I think it is lined. Is it lined? No, it is not lined, but it really seems to be a good quality fabric and it does come through the wash very nicely, but I would definitely wash this on delicate and then hang it dry and then steam it. Now, this is not exactly a dress. It is a culotte jumpsuit with kind of wide legs and it, I would say it's about ankle length and it has a self tie belt and I have worn it before with kind of a rattan straw belt and it looked really good. You could also add another belt and take this off. But this again, washes up beautifully. Again, wash it on delicate, hang it dry. Now I have the wrong undergarments on for this one for sure. This is a one shoulder dress. I'd have to wear a, a strapless bra with it. And here it is in the back. I think it's very, very nice. I think it's a little too informal though, maybe for Darlene's 90th birthday tomorrow. I think she wants a dress, so I'll wear one of the other ones. Let me know in the comment section which dress you like. Again, that would be great to know. Okay, this dress is very similar to the last dress I had on, but it is not a halter in the back. And I really do like that. It does have kind of a racer back look in the back, which gives me a little more coverage, which I really like. But again, it has the high halter neck in a red and white, but this comes in a ton of different colors. Has a cute little self-tie belt, but that does not bother me. I think that looks good. And again, it has the three-tiered skirt, and this one is a little bit longer perhaps than the other one. But let me know in the comment section if for a wedding or a birthday party, a 90th birthday party, I guess I don't have to be that specific, but would you be more in favor of wearing kind of a sundress like this or more of a tailored business-like looking dress? Which would be better for you? This dress I really, really, really do like. And I think this dress is from Anne Rebess, which is one of the larger fashion lines on Amazon. I really, really, really like this dress. And I'm not sure if it's too racy for a 90 year old's birthday party. I don't think it is. It'll be mostly family and then her friends. I think it's really kind of okay. Now, of course I have the wrong undergarment on with it, but it has a one shoulder look. And I like the ruffle that is on that one shoulder. And again, I like the Dream Pairs nude shoes with this. I think this could be a winner for tomorrow. It's between this in terms of how I'm feeling. It's between this dress and the black one and the red one, the solid dresses. I'm not sure about the sun dresses, but anyway, let me know what you think. Okay, now this dress I think is way too casual for the party, so I won't be wearing it to the party. I thought I would show it to you though, just in case you have a very casual occasion, you might like something like this. It has pockets that I really like. Of course, the bra is absolutely terrible with it. I would need to, to wear different undergarments with that. But it is a culotte jumpsuit. And I think it's really nice for like a beach party. Also, one thing I like, it has this tie in the back and that allows you to kind of tighten up the bodice by tying that tighter or looser. 
but I really do like this dress or this jumpsuit, I guess, but I think it is really wrong for the party, so I won't be wearing it. Okay, I hadn't thought I would really like this dress before I put it on again, but I really think I do like this dress. This is a nice little midi length or asymmetric length, I guess. It goes up here on this side and down on this side. It has a little ruffle. It's a little midi length sundress, and I think it's so cute. And then it does have the halter back, which I appreciate. It's not, well, actually it's not a halter back. It is more of a racer style back and it has a little more coverage. My back is not great. I guess I've gotten a lot of sun on my back, but I don't really like to show it. <laughs> the only problem I have is I have a knee replacement scar and there it is, but it doesn't really show too badly. And I can always use some leg makeup tomorrow to cover it. Now, this dress, I'm surprised that I like it, but I really kind of like it. Let me know in the comments section if you or me and going to your mother-in-law's 90th birthday party, would you wear this dress or one that looks a little more business-like? And I'll be showing some of those a little bit later. person and it is such a joy to be a part of the celebration of your 90 years. I hope you will be greatly blessed in the years ahead. That was very nice. nice. Well, that was a look at Darlene's 90th birthday party and the dress I finally chose to wear because right now when I'm making this video for you, I'm still really not sure. I'll wait till tomorrow and, and wear a few of the dresses, try them on and see what I think looks best. And I am just so excited that Darlene is happy and healthy and she celebrated her 90th birthday. Let me know in the comments section if you have older relatives that are doing well. Let me know in the comments section if you also have some relatives that are getting up there in age. And let me know a little bit about how they're doing. I hope they're doing well. Well, take care and I'll see you in my next video.